I have come a long way. I am no stranger to hardships, battles, and high tides. I got knocked down too many times. Sometimes I took too long to get back up. Other times I put my focus in the wrong place and went the wrong way. Life is more like a maze than an open road. So many dead ends, turns that lead nowhere, and most of the times it's impossible to see further than the narrow path you are threading. I see no point in looking too far ahead, only to realize later the path lying just in front of you is blocked. Most of the times now I focus only on my next step, one at a time, baby steps. Do you recall growing up? I used to think back of running around fields and forests when I was a kid, playing with branches and kicking footballs. The only worry was hitting people's cars while playing in the streets. They used to get mad. We broke a car window once. My neighbor kicked a small rock and a ball at the same time. He scored twice, between the posts with the ball, while the rock pierced through the car's rear window. The car owner was his grandpa, and I remember us being so scared of telling our parents what happened. Most of my memories and experiences growing up are now a blur. Only a selected few remained, most likely the stronger ones. Do you ever feel like you've grown too fast? Wonder where time has gone? Nowadays I worry about so much all the time. It's so hard to get a moment of childhood once in a while. Being an adult was having a toll on me, so I decided to take some time to rest. After an amazing dive in the hot springs, we were welcomed back in Portugal with some cold rain. But us, being more stubborn than the rain itself, decided to check out the forest anyways. This is the kind of place which is too chaotic for photography, but regardlessly beautiful in its own way. I feel like this is the kind of day and landscape that really invites you to look within and get lost in your own thoughts. We got back to the van and drove some more until I looked out the window to some beautiful clouds in the landscape. The scene was inviting. I was missing a bit of light with the sun being shy, but the clouds really caught my attention. So I decided to shoot some 4x5 as well as a couple of 35mm shots.
Later in the day, we visited Suaj, a traditional village in Jerez, with beautiful stone roads and stone houses. It's amazing how time flows in these places. People work the fields very hard, but stress is not in the air, as in the big cities. There is no competition and usually people are much more willing to give a hand and work together. I was researching a bit about the village and found out only about 600 people live there now, compared to 3,000 in the 60s. This is something affecting not only this village, but the whole interior of the country in general. There was a point in time when people started to run away from this lifestyle, searching for more opportunities, money, a different life. But the value in places like this is the mindset, how you live each day, enjoying what nature gives you. With all these subjects on my mind, I went for a walk nearby, towards the mountains. I took the camera with me and got some handheld shots. The yellow color was very prominent in this landscape. Once in a while, a bit of cloud would touch the mountain peak. I saw oxen and cows grazing, as well as horses. Every once in a while, the sun would peek through the clouds and bright up the landscape. back I checked out the river, both with the digital camera as well as the 4x5 with some black and white film. It's in moments like these that I realize how important time is for me, to enjoy it in the best way I possibly can. And in these travels, I am able to slow down time. Routine kills me. Doing the same thing every day makes me feel empty eventually. This is what makes me feel alive. And what I found out is that this feeling resonates with a lot of people. A lot of people mentioned the word regret of their choices, of wasting time, of not enjoying life more, of not spending more time with their loved ones. <laughs> I'm trying to find a balance and use their regrets as a warning. To try and live life differently and hopefully not make the same mistakes as they did. That's why we get up every morning and go. 
aimlessly towards any destination, but never aimless towards this one goal. Be happy. Thanks for watching. Consider subscribing if you like the video and want to see more in the future. And I'll see you next time.